Saving with Shay, and I am here for my midweek Walmart haul. Yes, I bought a gamey one this midweek. And as y'all know, they be playing games. They be like, psych! And so, um, for that, I need 18 offers for $5. We're still working on the bonfire, I believe it's called, bonus. And that one expires in like four days. So I'm hoping I can hopefully finish that off this weekend. With my luck, I won't even get a weekend bonus, so there will be no point in me holding any receipts over till Thursday. Um, in the comments, what it you guys did. So listen, I have a couple deals we're gonna be sharing at Vons, and I have a couple deals we're gonna be sharing at Target as well. I still keep getting questions about Walmart rewards. All right, I have like three or four videos I wanna say up on how to use Walmart rewards. Um, I'll link the most recent one in the description for you guys. Um, but with Walmart rewards, it's one or the other. So it's either Ibotta or it's Walmart rewards. If it's an awesome deal, I usually do it on both separate transactions. Um, and so with that being said, I'm gonna make this brief. We're gonna head over to Walmart. We're gonna see what kind of awesome deals. Oh, did I say subscribe? I'm tripping. Listen, if you're new here, and this is your first time seeing this lovely face, definitely subscribe. Also, make sure you smash like button, support your girl, and don't forget to make sure your post notifications are on as well. So without further ado, let's hop into Walmart, see what kind of awesome deals that we can grab this week. If you want to see what your girl got, you know what to do. Keep on watching. Okay, guys, really, really, really quick. You haven't seen me talk about the Rockstar deal because um, when I did this deal the last time, it was at Dollar Tree. They never, ever got back to me, and I've sent them numerous emails, and they have yet to respond. Um, so that's why I haven't been doing this deal anymore. Let me know in the comments. Have you guys had issues with Rockstar? Um, but they were getting back to me at first, but not the last time that I contacted them. And so that's why you haven't seen me do it. All right. So this first deal is on the Jimmy Dean. Just a reminder, this deal is still going on. I want to do this deal so bad, y'all. 14 grams of protein. I want to do it so bad, but I know for me, I shouldn't. Because I'm a greedy ass and I'll eat the whole damn box. But I'm just, no, can't do it. Okay, so listen. <laughs> so listen, this deal is on the Jimmy Dean's Chicken Buttermilk Biscuits, which sounds so freaking good. Um, For this, they are priced at $7.53. You want to grab a total of two of them. You'll pay $15.06 out of pocket, getting back six on swag bucks. And a total of $3.64 on checkoff. It brings me down to a dollar. I'm sorry, a dollar. Brings them down to $2.71 each, which is definitely not right, bad. Just a reminder that this Taco Bell dip deal is still on um, Shopkick. Um, they're priced at $4.18. You want to grab one of them, getting back 725 kicks on Shopkick, which is $2.90. Brings them down to $1.28 each. And then there is one for um, every flavor. And so, All right. yeah. and here we go again with the bushes. Um, Sidekicks, their price at 162, getting back 77 cents on Ibotta, brings them down to 85 cents each. I've been grabbing this one because it's really good, but I think I want to grab the black bean one and see if that one tastes good too. So yeah. Then we've got the Oikos Pro, um, price at a dollar and 54 cents, um, getting back 40 cents on Ibotta, makes it a dollar and 14 cents. Oh, you guys, look what I found. Look what I found. Ooh. Awesome hang tags. I'm gonna grab some, of course. All right, so next up is the Snapple. Now, there is three different ones for Shopkick, getting back 225 kicks, which is 90 cents. There's one for the kiwi strawberry. There's one for the, um, there's a sugar-free one for sure. And then there's a sun one. All right, so we're gonna grab this one here. It's priced at... 127 getting back 90 cents on Shopkick, making that 37 cents. Now, the limit on this is a limit of two, so I'm going to go ahead and just grab two. I'll check the freezers in the front um, and see if I can find um, the other Next flavors. It's going to be on the Palm Olive, just soap. It's priced at uh, $282. we are going to be grabbing one of them, um, getting back a dollar through Walmart cash. Now, I didn't get it last time, so I'm going to, I'm hoping it works this time around. 
Um, and then getting back a total of 225 kicks from Shopkick, which is 90 cents. And then last but not least, 75 cents from one of the sister apps, making this only 17 cents. This is still a pretty decent deal as well on the Ajax. This is the larger bottle. It's 28 ounces. It's priced at 274. Getting back a dollar on a bottle, bringing that down to 174. All right, so this next deal is on the Poise. It is priced at $5.97. I'm gonna grab the 30 count. I'm getting back $2 on Ibotta. And there's also $3 on Shopman. Like, Shopman? Are we doing an offer on Shopman? It's final days, right? And then I'm also gonna get back $3 on Swagbucks, making this a $2.03 moneymaker. Really quick, this is what the little rollback flags look like. Um, and so, yeah, there are some over here, too. That just makes it easier to see clearance because when there's no flag, you really have to look. And so, yeah. So this next deal, I totally forgot to mention this on my last video. I did have it in the Google Doc, um, but it actually got a lot better. But this store has only had the same one for like the last few days and they haven't restocked yet. So it's on the Bellway Super Fiber. They're priced at $18.88 for this. You want to grab two of them. You want to pay $37.76 at a pocket. You'll get back. Well, there's two separate um, BOGO offers. One is through Isles. The other one is through, uh, what is it called? It's called VTAGS. And then you'll also get back 50% on social nature which is 944 making this a nine dollar and 44 cent money maker now again i'm hoping that the store restocks eventually before the offers um, expire but this is the only store in my area that carries it and so, yeah. all right so this next deal i'm not going to be doing i just want to share it with you i mean if it pops up on another app like shopkick or something like that um i probably will do it but it's on the emergency kids crystals now they do have this in a, the adult one it's like sixteen dollars though so this one's a much better deal it's priced at eleven dollars and eighty two cents getting back two on ibotta three dollars and sixty two cents on checkout fifty one and three dollars on swag bucks making this three dollars and twenty cents are you guys tired of seeing this deal it's on the arm and hammer uh toothpaste they're priced at 3.98 um i'm still i'm still i've still been finding the peelies on these y'all for a dollar fifty so use one of those peelies hang tags whatever you want to call it um, that'll bring your total down to you paying two forty eight. You'll get back to one I bought a, um, making this only forty eight cents with a limit of five. Of course, Walmart's system only will allow four light coupons, and so definitely not a bad deal. I just saw the cutest little girl. She was so darn stinking cute. She had a little dress and oh, so so darn cute. I said if I try, I just know I'm I'm past the year of trying, y'all. Let me just say that. I'm past the year of the trying, but if I did, I know I'd have another boy. <laughs> but listen, this deal is on the Hello 8 and 10. 8 and 1. <laughs> Price is uh, $6.26. For this, you want to grab one of them. I'm not going to do this deal, um, but you'll get back $3 on Ibotta. There's also 550 kicks on Shopkick, which is $2.20, making that $1.06. Have you guys tried this toothpaste? Because once I'm finished with the one I'm using now, I'm going to switch to this one. So if you've tried this one, let me know in the comments. Okay, so literally, I've been doing this deal with the ink box tattoos like every day. Like this is the third day in a row that I've did it for both Ibotta and Walmart rewards. Um, grabbing two of them at a dollar. Just make sure you scan them, whether it be through the app. When you're scanning for Walmart rewards, scan it on the app. Make sure that the three dollar uh, three dollar reward is attaching to that particular one because it's not working with all of them just just like all of them are not working for the ibotta offer so make sure you scan them for both so you're going to grab one of them at a dollar getting back three i'm making it to all the money maker with a limit of two so i've been grabbing two per transaction that last three days and i think this might be the last and final set for me right, so this last deal is only penetrix i got this deal yesterday um you're gonna have one at twenty dollars and thirteen cents Getting back four on Ibotta, four seventy nine on Checkout fifty one, four dollars on Spike Bucks, and three dollars on Tada, making that four dollars and thirty four cents. So here is our complete haul for today. So deals I did not mention in the video: the Fabuloso is at Bond, so is the Stem. Uh, Fabuloso three ninety nine, and there's three dollar digital, making that ninety nine cents. I figured, why not? That's cheaper than Dollar Quarter Tree. <laughs> 
And then the stem is on sale this week for $15.99 and there is a $10 digital for that. So I paid $5.99 and got back $10 on Ibotto. So I made that a $4 money maker. And then at Target, I grabbed the Tresemme trial size, um, the styling gel for $2.99. $3 digital made that three. What else did I do at Target? Oh, I did the Go, Go Macros again. Um, with this, I used a different email address, but this time it had me verify my phone number, which it's never done before. Um, and this is the third time that I've done it. And so it's on sale for $8.49, getting back a dollar on Ibotta and $8.49 through a sample offer, making it a dollar money maker. The Shea Moisture. So originally when I did this deal at Target, I grabbed the larger bar, which is the eight ounce. It was the wrong one. So, but I already had submitted my receipt to Fetch Reward. I got back $3 for that one. And then I had realized it was the wrong one, didn't work for Ibotta, so I returned it and grabbed uh, the smaller bar, which this is on the regular aisle, not the trial section. Um, and so it's $4.99, getting back four on Ibotta, and then $3 through Fetch Reward. And then I also have a spend 20, get back 250 offer. So, for this, two of them counted because I went back the next day and I grabbed two on separate transactions. And so I only got credit for two of them on Fetch Reward. And I got back the $250 as well because I'd scanned that fourth one. So I got back $3 for two and then $250 for spending $20 on that. Now I thought about taking back one of them because the offer on Ibotta did change. And it no longer included it but all three bars end up being like a dollar and are so money maker anyways so i may go ahead and um and keep them but this offer is no longer working for um for ibotta and i think i think that basically covers it we did the armor all armor all <laughs> we did the arm and hammer twice i did the ink box i maxed it out so my last haul i think i did it twice for walmart rewards and ibotta and this time i did it three days in a row for both now the last that i did for walmart rewards it didn't go through so i figured because the second set that i got it actually took longer to um to process for some reason i know one of you guys said it took like six hours but i don't know how long it took i just know the next day when i checked it was there um the second, the third set rather, I didn't um, take it back because I was like, okay, maybe it'll eventually hit and it never did. So this morning I took it back, returned them and repurchased them and then it hit. All right. So we did that deal, ended up being a $2 money maker for every set of two. Other than that, you guys, everything you see here retails $126.43. I had $28 in um, coupons or digitals which brought the out-of-pocket down to $98.43. My sales tax was $9.72. And then we walk away with $66.57 from Ibotta, um, $19 from Walmart Rewards, $8.52 from Fresh Rewards, $3.75 from Inbox Dollars, uh, $3 for Shopmium, $3 for Tada, $3 for Brand Club, and $2.80 from Shopkick. Now, really quick, with the um, Arm & Hammer, the set that I did today, the cashier accidentally charged me for five. And, you know, I bought us really finicky when you return stuff. But because it was an extra item scanned, I couldn't just return it without the receipt. So when I submitted my receipt, I did change the um, number to four. And I still got back credit for five. So I put a ticket in just letting them know, hey... I was overcharged for one of them. I returned it, but I only submitted for four. Because no matter how many times you explain to them, they always make it seem like you deliberately did it. Like you did it on purpose. Like you know you can't return something um, and, and get credit for something and return it. You know, like I deliberately did it. And so um, I am not counting that extra $2 for the fifth one. And so walking away with a total of $109.64. Uh, makes everything you see here free plus an $11.21 money maker. Um, with tax, we still make $1.49, which is definitely still not bad. Other than that, I appreciate you guys watching. If you make it to the end, I want to see... Let me see a butterfly in the comments if you get to the end. As always, I appreciate you guys watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.